I have that partnership with Delta, and I think we all have a partnership with them. At 50 years of age, I've never been so proud of what I'm doing and the company that I work for as I am today. I need to use my own voice because Delta's willing to listen. I'm married, I'm a mother, also of three kids. Flight attendants my entire career. That's pretty much what I've been doing my whole life. I've been flying with Delta for one year. My one year anniversary was January 8th, uh, 2015. I've been with Delta Airlines four years now. I used to be with Southwest Airlines for eight years, but I always wanted to be a flight attendant for Delta. I believe that anyone who has not experienced Delta cannot really understand Delta. I don't need someone who's not familiar with what I'm going through day in and day out to have a voice for me. If the IM gets in, I think there's a lot at stake. I'm not incredibly excited about paying these dues every month for somebody to represent me in a company I want to represent me. If I'd have to talk to someone that doesn't have my Delta interest. Who's not a Delta person? Who doesn't feel it? Who doesn't have the Delta widget blood running through them? I don't think they could understand where I'm coming from or how they can take it further. I'm most afraid of losing the relationship with Delta. They still have those values, ethics, morals, high standards, and I don't want to lose that communication with my Delta. Delta takes care of me, and I don't have to worry about it, and that is what I'm afraid would go away. The flexibility in my schedule, A days versus reserve every other month, like all the airlines have, nobody else has that, and we did all that without a union. Are we willing to give up what we have for the unknown? Once you're in a contract, it's hard to get out of a contract. Delta is completely open-ended on wanting the communication between employees and corporate. There is no middleman. At one point, you start to realize you're not just talking to your bosses, you're talking to fellow employees. I'll go to the office and knock on the door, excuse me, when you have a moment, sure, Tor, what do you need? They get up from behind the desk, come over to me. What are you doing? What do you need help with? You always feel supported. You know they take care of you and you take care of your customers. We have a commitment and we have a passion. Quite often, I look back at almost 35 years and I said to myself, if I had to do it all over again, I would do it the exact same way. It's not like it's even a job, it's your passion. And that shows. My daughter could have had the opportunity to work for other companies and I urged her to be a Delta flight attendant. First, she wanted to be a Delta flight. She wanted to be like her mother. Everything that, that I've done at Delta. I want my daughter to experience it because yes, it's been fun. It's been a wonderful ride. That's my Delta.